step on that, dude. Why not? Dude, don't step on that. Get off. Why? You don't know where that's been? It's been on the ground. See, some homeless person could have wiped his butt with that. Yeah, you're right, 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 you're right. You're out here kicking shoes, stepping on hoodies. What's wrong with you? I'm sorry, man, I'm sorry. Yo, peace, 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 guys. Um, I'm over here by where I used to be, like, shooting by that theater that's just kind of right over there. And this was the spot where I shot the, um, the Gundam sneakers, right? And when I pulled up, because I just got to get this off real quick. This is the same day Comac where I were just... Comac and I were just downtown doing all that. He had to go, he had a wedding to go to, and I had to keep the show going. So I figured I'd come back here real quick just to get these bunnies done real fast. But I noticed my dude in the Suburban is back and he's right over there on this tree. I don't wanna just like show the, you know, there he is, but he's over there and I'll probably get him when I start doing the on foot shots. But I just, you know, I feel all warm and fuzzy cause we kind of reunited and you know, he had to find a new spot. He's under a tree and um, I'm just glad we're back. My guy keeps watching me over there though. Let's see if I can catch him. Where is he? Let's see if he's, is he back. He's watching me. I know he's back there somewhere. Where is he? Boom, 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 boom. We'll see. Ah, ah, ah. Here you are, buddy. Let me give him an over the shoulder zoom in. Boom, 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 boom. Say cheese. So yeah, I'm out. I'm out. I'm out. I'm done playing around. And it's cold. I'm saying. <laughs> Now, you can't you can't get them all like I'm lucky I had Comac earlier because the stuff that we shot earlier was really good had to switch to the iPhone and all of that but it, it worked out so this one I just couldn't I just couldn't get it let me look at my shirt for Christ's sakes I slept in this thing last night so go ahead and end the video here guys and go back to the editing boards you know I always um, put try to, to do something different uh, for the people Yo, what's good, everybody? We are back, and today we have a pair of sneakers that's very interesting, and I wanted them when they first came out really, really bad, and I saw them on the the market, and, you know, people kind of weren't trying to send them out, so shout out to Morgan. Shout out to Morgan for sending me these sneakers, and I know they kind of didn't want to either. They probably wanted to send me a Jordan 1, a Jordan 4, some Travis mess like that, but no, we're doing the Bad Bunnies, and... I don't really know much about Bad Bunny's music, but I do know he's kind of a, he's a wild dude. And was that a stamp I just showed? You might have to go back and look at that. I think there's a couple stamps on here. I don't, I don't know. But is that a woman? That, that is a woman. Like, that looks like the woman's room. Like, you know when you go to the ladies room? Is it, is it the wrong? I don't, I don't know. I don't know. But anyway, this, this package I actually unboxed on my IG live. Some of you that are watching this now were there. And I was like, whoa, this is, I actually packaged it up a little bit better than they sent it to me, but that really doesn't matter. So let's go ahead and open these up again and make sure you subscribe to me on uh, IG or follow me on IG, whatever it means, it's, you know, just make sure you hit me up there because you get to see me in a little bit more raw element and I don't keep the live. So I'm, I'm going, I'm going in on them live. So make sure you follow me on IG. But what do we have here? We have the bad bunnies. And at this point, I'm kind of late to the game with these. I watched my man AB's video um, before doing this and his was looking all clean and pretty. And at this point, there's a black pair and there's like maybe a brown pair, but this pair stood out the most. And I think this might be the first colorway. And yes, those were like little bunny ears, I guess. The laces, 
I'm not sure about these laces. I'm going to probably just get rid of them or not use them. But they're interesting color. They're like kind of earth tony laces. I don't know why you get blue. And AB put blue and a green one in his too. And I thought that was kind of interesting. It actually didn't look that bad. But the sneaker is a superstar. And I probably had one pair of superstars in my life. Like when I was a youngster when you couldn't. I couldn't get my hands on like the Nikes at the time. So Adidas were like the downgrade back in my day if you couldn't get the Nikes because Kareem Abdul-Jabbar and all those dudes were kind of played out by the time I stepped into the game and Jordan came around and all that. But anyway, I do like the shoe. They have this little booty in the back. And I went with a size 10 because I was scared. I, I, I should have went with a 9.5 on these. So go true to size. I went a size 10. And I haven't wore a superstar in like 20 years. So I just kind of figured if you go a half size up, I'd be okay. But I had to tighten these up a little bit more. Even with that little bunny booty right there in the back, I had to kind of tighten these up. And that little pull tab in the back didn't really tighten the shoe at all. It doesn't really have that much function. I mean, I pulled it and it didn't, it tightened, but it didn't tighten the shoe. So I don't really understand that. Here's some of the straps and they snap on, right? And then you strap it under the little bunny eye thing right there. And I, it took me a while to kind of figure it out. I actually think I have it wrong right there, but who cares? I'll probably do one. I'll probably just model them just like that. One off, one on. And underneath the black light, I think I found some very small, minimal markings on these. Nothing like you see on a Jordan 1. Well, sort of. Like, that mark's there. That's the mark right there where they line them up. You know, they had to line that up somehow. If they didn't use these markings, by the way, the shoe would look like crap. It would look like I made it or something like that. It would, it would look like crap. But this is, this is pretty much spot on. I don't have an original. I've never seen the original or authentic sneaker. But this is as good as it's going to get for me. So shout out again, Morgan, for getting these to me. And, um, okay, I was just making sure there's no stamps. I, I think that was a stamp on the box, but make sure you check out the rest of the videos. Peace, love, and light. And I'll catch y'all on the next one. Notification. Yeah,